Hi everyone, today we're going to be working on this purple and white water marble. And you may be noticing that the white is showing up a little bit more like lavender. And that is because I am using purple as my base color. If you wanted the white to be more dominant or more opaque, then I would suggest to go with the white as your base color. But after some testing, I decided that I just preferred the way it looked this way myself. Um, both of the colors that I'm using today are by Orly. The white is Aw Champagne, and the purple is Fantasy. And while I wouldn't specifically call this a wedding day water marble, it is one of the few that I've done using white, so you could certainly substitute your wedding color instead of purple. I'm going to start off going just up to the top and then down to the bottom and then I'm going to draw in a couple petals from each side just drawing a few from one side to the other and then repeating that in the bottom half of the cup and then I'm going to draw two from the top down to the bottom and this is creating just kind of a planned random design I have my nails prepped with fantasy and I'm going to turn the cup just a bit before I take aim with my nails and dip in here just want to try to get them all to hit the surface at the same time and then can reach in and clean up the excess polish so it doesn't stick on top of the good part of your design and then oops almost missed that go ahead and pull your nails out of the water and there's the water marble design if you guys would like to see some more pictures, you can check out my blog, mysimplelittlepleasures.blogspot.com. If you'd like to see some more from Water Marble March, the playlist is linked in the information box. And as always, thanks for watching.